All right, so we have the FT-991, and I just wanted to show how to record your voice in a voice recorder in the different memory slots, and then also how to play it back on the air. So the first thing you want to make sure is that you have break-in off, because break-in, when you hit the memory keys, which you'll see on the screen after you've programmed them, that will be, that will be the, I guess, the difference between if it just plays audibly on the speaker or if it plays over the air which is what we want eventually but we want to have that off when we go in to set it up so now we're going to go back over to the screen to set it up here's our memory configuration we have four or actually in this case five slots <clears throat> excuse me so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hit memory and then I'm going to hit channel one I'm going to record my voice on my microphone and then I'm gonna hit memory again, okay? So I'm gonna hit memory, I'm gonna hit channel one, and then I'm gonna record. This is kilowatt delta zero, Sierra Golf X-ray. Then when I'm done, I'm just gonna hit memory again, okay? Now you can hit memory as soon as you're done speaking so that you don't hear the click of the mic unkeying, which is a little bit better. Now if you wanna hear that back, we can just hit this. This is kilowatt delta zero, Sierra Golf X-ray. Now you notice, I've got, got it hooked and it did hear me. <laughs> but you can see the power was output was nothing. So I'll do it again. This is kilowatt so it delta didn't, zero, Sierra Golf X-ray. It didn't actually go out over the air. Now I'm gonna hook a dummy load on here. Well, I already have the dummy load. And I'm gonna go and turn on break in, okay? I turn that on. Now we go back over to our channels. And now if you watch the power, it's going to be 50 watts, so I don't know where it's going to go up here, maybe here. But with the dummy load, this is kilowatt delta you can zero. see the power is going out. So, and that's because I didn't hit the memory button right away. I set the mic down. So that's how you record a slot, channel one, or memory voice key in this case. Um, if you want to do that, you can do it four or five times to each bank, one in each bank. So you have different sounding, uh, uh, you know, or maybe you can say 73s <laughs> if you don't want to talk all day. But that's basically how you do it in a nutshell.